Okay, I think they heard you. make sure we could see I want to know where it's at yeah okay there it is all right you want to get in what's up mofos what, what was I gonna say I forgot what I was gonna say what's up mofos today's episode uh. <laughs> <laughs> what's up mofos today's episode and pint night brings us to latitude 33 brewing right here behind us we're gonna go in and check it out <laughs> So just around the corner from the seating and the lounge chair area, the pool table, stuff like that, is a brewery. And the tap room, the bar is over here just to the right. Let's go check that out. Just to the opposite side of the bar, we've got the brewery. Probably brewing our beer for pint night. trying the blonde right now it's uh the blonde is a let me get that sign 5.1 blonde ale 25 ibu yeah it's a good clean smooth beer uh, the other ones that we have here are the blood orange and and the honey hips so this blood orange is what i'm trying right now this is what we have going on for pint night on thursday which is tomorrow night which is actually last night once this video is out <laughs> it's not bad last one is the honey hips it's not bad. It's not blowing me away, but it's good, you know. That's the mango habanero. It's mango habanero. Ha mango try habanero, again? and I can I can taste the habanero now. It's actually burning. Hey, you do get a little hint. Now, do you remember the last episode where I was talking about how um, we wanted to be honest? Yeah. I'm gonna be completely honest. Oh, yeah. ha Hannah was her name, right? Yeah. She was nice, but but I feel like everybody else around here is kind of like looking at us like, well, who the fuck are these guys? And oh, yeah. we don't have time for you kind of thing, which is not a very welcoming feeling. So no. you're done? All right, let's get the fuck out of here. This show is supposed to be about food and beer. So we're gonna incorporate a little food today. Uh, Although <laughs> it's not our food, it's food. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> what? I just took my mic off. <laughs> no, no, the off? mic is on here. Oh. Anyways, so my wife and my kids and I came to this place probably, about, I think it was actually a year ago. I got a Facebook memory mention on there, a reminder. But it's called The Wooden Spoon in Escondido, California. It's really good, really good steak. So let's go see, let's go check it out again. Yeah. You know, we're so I don't know if you can. 
So, nice to meet you. Emerson. I'm Elizabeth. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. So, the food was amazing. Nice. So, thank you very much. I knew it would be amazing, somehow. <laughs> so, what, what's, was, the, what's the deal with this? I was running a restaurant in Italy yeah. uh, called Pacific Standard. Check this out. That's her, guys. That's her right there. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I just put the mic in the beer. Oh, shit. That's not good. Maybe it's just the net. Okay, so somebody we kicked out last, what? Three weeks ago. Three prime nights ago is back. After he gave us a bad After, review. Yeah. Here, you gotta talk in. After he gave us a bad review. After he gave us a bad review. You can't slam it down or else it's gonna make noise. <laughs> After he gave us a bad review, after he puked, after he knocked over three beers, after he knocked a beer into our band member's guitar case. <laughs> Excuse me. My name is Emerson, one of the owners. Is this your first time here? Yeah, yeah it is. It is. My name is Emerson. This is Rob, Rob, get over here. Get over here. This is Rob, he's the other owner. Rob. Hey, how's it going? Just wanted to, thank you. Just wanted to help you out with a selection. If, yeah. You know, if you have best sellers are the sriracha cheesesteak, if you like a little spice. Cool. Oh no, we did. We ran out of latitude glasses. Dude, we're totally out. <laughs> Completely out. Someone stole my hat. The hat I had up there. <laughs> yeah. That's the way it goes around here. <laughs> What's up, guys? We're here with Keegan from. What's going on? What's up, guys? We're here with Keegan from Latitude 33. <laughs> Latitude 33. Yeah. Good to be here. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. So I noticed you do. I was looking you up. Yeah. You did some live stuff already, so you're you're used to this. Yeah, yeah. So I like to do like live promotional stuff. Just talk about the beer. I mean, that's, that's really what it's all about. Cool. Um, so tell us a little bit about uh, Blood Orange, and then we'll roll yeah. into Honey Hips. So our Blood Orange IPA is actually our number one uh, top selling beer down in San Diego. Um, it has been around for, believe it or not, about two years. Uh, it got really popular about a year ago, and we uh, basically um, just ran with it. And if you go down to San Diego right now, Pacific Beach, Mission Bay, La Jolla, it's just everywhere. Everyone, everyone enjoys it. Uh, it's, it's, you know, it's the next big thing. Um, Honey Hips is our uh, strong blonde ale, so it's actually a double blonde. Uh, fermented with honey, so it's actually kind of like a mead as well, like a hybrid. Um, and we've actually brewed honey hips the longest, uh, but it's a unique style because it's 8.3% alcohol, but it's not uh, really hoppy, uh, it's not really, you know, like bitter. Um, so a lot of people who ask for, you know, something that's light, but still has the higher kick to it, definitely recommend the honey hips. Uh, nice sweet flavor. We also add rose hips in the boil process, so it gives it a nice kind of aromatic uh, uh, hint on the nose, which is nice. Yeah. You know, so, yeah. Two, our two most popular beers, and you can get them down here at Sax. So. <laughs> cool, cool. Yeah. How long has Latitude 33 been around? So, believe it or not, we've been around for about five years. Uh, 2011, like towards the end of 2011 is when we kind of came around, and then uh, uh, we didn't actually, I mean, we operated as like a boutique brewery uh, up until like, I want to say like 2015, towards the end of 2015, yeah. uh, and then we expanded outside of San Diego, uh, mostly into Orange County, LA. Inland Empire, uh, and we're trying to uh, take the brand even bigger than that. So, so do you guys only have one brewing facility now? We do. Um, the plans are to open up a new one soon, like a brew pub. Uh, Dude, <laughs> it ran out fast tonight. Yeah. They ran out fast. Um, the Maybe next, next time, three, Hopefully. four cases. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah well, I can, I can bring new beers next time, you know? <laughs> um, but yeah, so we're opening up a, uh, um, hopefully soon, a brew pub, uh, probably within the Anaheim area. 
um, is what we're kind of kind of what we're going for. There's a lot of other breweries opening up over there, like uh, Modern Times, Golden Road. Yeah. Carl Strauss has a brewery yeah. right by Angels Stadium. So. Golden Road's just doing their remodel, I guess, over there. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Right on. I have to. I, I'm just going to be completely and a hundred percent honest with you. Okay. Let's hear it. <laughs> well, we went down to the brewery. We didn't get a very good welcome. Okay. Um, but I'd have to say that this has kind of like evened it out. Yeah, yeah. We got a good turnout here. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. People love the beer. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? We but, have a fan base, definitely. So, so we, from our experience in going to breweries, we've we've had such an overwhelming like they pour their hearts out to yeah. us. You know what I mean? And help us out. I don't know if they were just busy that day or what was going on, but we <laughs> felt like we were not wanted there. Yeah. <laughs> And honestly, you probably weren't. Um, but we, not, we not, probably weren't. Not, not <laughs> just uh, at the time. Uh, we do yeah. have a brew schedule, uh, which is a busy one. Uh, you know, we we we're kind of seen as like a small brewery, but we're actually really busy, like really big down San Diego. So we, we do brew a lot of beer during the day. Uh, we don't. They don't really like. You don't really see people. Uh, we. Uh, you know, we, the brewers are mostly working, and uh, any any staff that deals with like you know like the brew pub itself, which opens at four, wouldn't be there. So uh, yeah, no, I know. I I probably I don't know if I should let, yeah, let you guys go down there. You guys, they should take you and train those people. For <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I mean. Get that guy a raise. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> regardless, we run a restaurant, right? Yeah. So yeah. Regardless yeah. of how busy we are in the back. Right. You know, if somebody called for us up front, we'd take the time out. You know, that's kind of just how we felt. Like every brewery we visited has done that. Regardless, right. the uh, one of the breweries we visited two weeks ago, they were putting in a brand new centrifuge. He had the the text there doing it. He was okay. in the middle of doing it. He took 15 minutes out and talked to us, educated us on the beer, all that stuff. So that's what we're used to. Yeah. But when um, what's her name, Hannah? Yeah, Hannah. Was Hannah was great. Hannah was great. Hannah's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. she was really cool. Um, she went and asked one of the, the brewers to give us five minutes, and he said no. <laughs> We're like, yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Our our brewers, yeah, they get pretty busy. Um, yeah, I mean, like, I don't know, I don't know what to say. <laughs> uh, I do have to say, I want to tell, I want to tell everybody that, that it's, it, it is what it is. You know what I mean? They're they were busy, but um, the turnout tonight obviously got a following. Obviously, yeah. the beer is good. I love the beer. Um, so thank you for that. You know no, yeah, absolutely. Thank you for, yeah, yeah. Thank you for doing. Uh, what they had that was good was that mango habanero. Oh yeah, the mango mesa. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So uh, I know, I know, I'm in Rancho, and you know, you guys have Hamilton's double mango, uh, but we do a mango based IPA, um, which is kind of more of a tropical citrusy IPA with. Uh, uh, habanero that we add to the boil process, yeah. so it gives it a little bit of a spice. What, but if you guys had it, was it was it too spicy? No, I didn't think it was too spicy. I didn't think it was spicy until it hit here. Yeah. It yeah. Here. <laughs> that uh, mango habanero, when you taste it, you, you you get that mango hint, but the yeah. habanero comes at the back end. And Rob is even saying like like a, few, a couple minutes later is when he was starting to hit. hit yeah, and what's cool habanero. about it is the habanero actually kind of plays off the hop characteristics because hops are typically really bitter. But then the habanero, you get the habanero Nero in there, which comes in at the end, just like just like hops do. Yeah, I didn't taste any bitter. It was good. Yeah, and it kind of changes the flavor a little bit. So yeah, the mango mesa, that's going to be one of our top sellers pretty soon. Um, How yeah. was everything? Awesome. <laughs> yeah, awesome. that's what I'm talking about. Thanks, man. Yeah. Uh, all right. You got any other questions for him? No? Okay. Dude, thank you for everything. Absolutely. Appreciate it. The beer is great. Yeah. Thank you very Thanks much. Thanks for having me, guys. I uh, hope you guys come back to the brewery. Hopefully when I'm there, we will. We'll, we'll yeah. come back. We'll come back. <laughs> <laughs> now I'll give you. I'll give you guys a grand tour. Cool. Um, um, social media. Anything like that you want to plug? Yeah. So you can follow us on Instagram. Uh, we usually post updates about what's going on at the brewery, uh, and then we also have a Facebook page. Uh, you know the usual, like yeah. whatever. Whatever I'll, else has. I'll link it. I'll link it in the bottom, guys. In uh, yeah. The, so it's latitude. Latitude 33 Brewing. Latitude 33 Brewing. Yeah, Got yeah. Okay. Yeah. That should be the, the handle, I believe. Yeah. Cool. So. All right, yeah, yeah. I'll link it up. All right, cool. be sure to follow us. Thanks again, dude. Absolutely. Appreciate it. Yeah. Great See you time. Later, guys. Man.